wrestling is weird, isn't it? Anyway, uh, AJ Styles, the phenomenal one, just won the WWE World Heavyweight Championship against Jinder Mahal on SmackDown Live. What the fuck? Really? I hate it. No, I, I love it. I absolutely love it. I, I cannot be happier. It sucks that it was uh, on England, so we couldn't see it live. It's gonna air later. So I'm recording this uh, before SmackDown. But I see in pictures, and uh, it's impossible to not get leaked. Like, if you put, if you go to social media, it's all, all over the internet. AJ Styles is a WWE champion, and this is the picture. This happened on SmackDown Live, and I think it's a footage that aired on uh, England. So yeah, that's real. That is definitely real. AJ is the WWE champion. This is what WWE posted on their app. New champion crowned at SmackDown Live in UK. AJ Styles defeated Jinder Mahal to capture the WWE Championship at SmackDown Live in Manchester, England. WWE.com can confirm. This marks the Phenomenal One's second reign as WWE Champion and it's also the first time in history that the WWE Championship has changed hands outside of North America. Find out how it all went down and how it affects the battle for brand supremacy at Survivor Series by tuning in on SmackDown Live tonight. It's fucking awesome. It's fucking great. So for those who don't know, it was announced on social media that AJ Styles is going to face Jinder Mahal for WWE Championship. Originally, Rusev was supposed to face AJ Styles for the spot on Survivor Series team. Seems like that's not gonna happen, huh? And I'm happy. Everybody thought that it's too predictable that they're going to feed AJ Styles to Jinder Mahal, so Jinder Mahal looks good, goes to face Brock Lesnar, but right now it's so much more entertaining and interesting. AJ vs Brock, this pay-per-view is saved. I give a shit about it. I, I talked about how do you need to change some championships to, uh, you know, to make something interesting on this pay-per-view, because it's, it's not interesting. The matches were really, really... You know, not paper worthy. Brock Lesnar versus Jinder Mahal. I have no fucks given, and this is this is pretty good. And this is something that we can look forward to. It's main event worthy. Now I don't want to see AJ Styles squashed, and I think that's not gonna happen. AJ Styles gonna give him a good beating, phenomenal forearms to get the beast down. So this is the match that you are going to see on pay-per-view if AJ Styles is not going to lose the championship on uh, before the pay-per-view. That would really suck. No, don't you ever think about doing that. If next week Jinder Mahal Maharaja is going to defeat AJ Styles for the championship. No, don't even, I don't want to even think about it. WWE, don't be that stupid, please. I smell some bullshit, I smell that it's gonna happen, and it smells like shit. It smells like really, really nasty, fat, juicy shit. And this right here, I mean, you have two people who are worthy champions. Brock Lesnar is a beast, he makes the title look good, AJ Styles is a workhorse, he makes the title look good, he deserves it the most out of the roster. It, it's, it makes sense, Raw vs SmackDown. This is also a picture that Smack Talks took on SmackDown Live. He's also the guy who spoiled it for me, so thank you. Oh, and also the WWE Tag Team Raw Tag Team Championships changed hands on Raw. The Usos, not, not the Usos, the Shield lost it to Sheamus and Cesaro. And I do believe, yes, we're gonna get Sheamus and Cesaro versus the Usos. Not as good as the Shield versus the Usos, but I, I do think it's gonna be an entertaining match because well, Cesaro is a great wrestler, Sheamus is a great wrestler, the Usos are great wrestlers, it's gonna be a good match. And uh, the only reason I think they did it, because you cannot just leave the Shield, right? And we have a full Raw uh, team for Survivor Series, so what the fuck uh, Seth Rollins and uh, Dean Ambrose are going to do? I do believe that Roman Reigns is going to return and they are going to face... Uh, the, 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 the New Day, because they interfered. So it's gonna be The Shield versus The New Day, 3-on-3. Three three. It makes a lot of sense in my opinion, and I do believe that is the reason why they put uh, the titles uh, of um, The Shield. Isn't it? Doesn't make any sense? I think it does. Now the thing I wanna talk- now, now another thing I really wanna talk about, the AJ Styles winning the WWE Championship. Is it a sign? That uh, we're gonna see Shinsuke Nakamura versus AJ Styles at WrestleMania. I believe that would be cool. That would be really cool. Like the word "cool" really fits right here. You know, 
I think they're going with they they wanted to go with Jinder Mahal versus Bro, Jin, John Cena at WrestleMania for the WWE Championship. You know, John Cena the crowns, Jinder Mahal, 17th world title, whatever. It's bullshit. That doesn't sound cool. Lesnar versus Reigns and Jinder versus Cena. It doesn't scream cool, you know? Like, when you think about cool, NWO, Bullet Club, AJ versus Nakamura seems cool. It really, it really does. And I think it would make sense. Like, when you look at New Japan Pro Wrestling, we are going to have Chris Jericho versus Kenny Omega. Someone who has never seen any match from New Japan Pro Wrestling. I'm going to watch it for the first time ever. So it shows you how great that business decision is to put Chris Jericho to New Japan Pro Wrestling against Kenny Omega. A lot of WWE fans are going to watch this. I've seen on Twitter a lot of people ordering, asking how to order New Japan Pro Wrestling. I want to see it. And I'm going to watch it. Hopefully I'm going to see it live because this is this is the probably the biggest match of 2018. I really think so. And... Uh, it's hard for WrestleMania to top that. And if we're gonna have Shinsuke versus AJ, I think it's a right way to do. It would be such a shame if AJ loses the championship before the WrestleMania or even before Survivor Series. It would be the worst decision they could do. Like, knowing Miss McMahon, it could be one of these moments. Oh, AJ Styles is uh, the WWE Champion right now, but uh, they don't know that uh, next week <laughs> I'm going to make Jinder Mahal Champion again. Oh, and for those who wonder how AJ Styles won the match, roll it. I mean, the crowd is insane. Every time WWE goes to UK, the crowd is good. They're happy to see WWE. And I love that they go to UK. I absolutely love that. It's just a shame that everything gets spoiled because of time differences. Let's see what people think about this AJ Styles WWE Championship victory. AJ Styles just became the first superstar in 54 years to win the WWE title outside of North Carolina. America. That is something. That is something to brag about, to be quite honest with you. Youngest champion, Randy Orton. Most title wins, John Cena, Ric Flair. And this is something that will go to records. I'm happy about that. AJ Styles deserves it. And I'm happy that he's two-time WWE champion. Smackdown Life just got better. AJ Styles is the new WWE champion. Life is good. It really is. I also want to see the reaction of Jinder Mahal when he... Next week, will appear on SmackDown Live and what he thinks about it. The whole match against Brock Lesnar that he proposed is over because AJ Styles isn't that spot. Paul tweeted, When Jinder wins the title back next week. Don't you break my feelings like that, Pulse. <sighs> it's going to be an attempt to bring more heat to Jinder Mahal, make him more hateable, and for fuck's sakes... AJ vs Jinder Mahal tonight is probably the best match of Jinder's entire career. I really, I, I really cannot wait to see that. Honestly, Jinder Mahal doesn't have a lot of good matches, but when he steps in the ring with uh, AJ Styles, you know that it's going to be phenomenal. AJ Styles can make a great match with my balls. A little 450 splash, phenomenal forearm. Wait a second, I don't understand this. SmackDown Live is going to be live in two hours, so how is AJ Styles the champion now when it's not even live yet? It's happening in England. Time differences. Here you go, buddy. Anyway, current changes for Survivor Series are these WWE Tag Team Champions, Raw Tag Team Champions Cesaro and Sheamus versus the SmackDown Live Tag Team Champions The Usos and another match that has changed, Brock Lesnar versus AJ Styles Battle of World Schworld Champions. Let me know in the comments below what do you think about these changes of the pay-per-view. Thanks for watching this video, make sure to leave a like 
button. Make sure to follow me on Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, especially on Twitter or on Instagram, man. I don't have a lot of followers. I really don't. Like, I see a lot of YouTubers who have massive followers on Twitter, and I'm just, I really suck at plugging things, bro. So make sure to go to my Twitter, leave a follow, tweet me something. I may follow you back. Thank you very much. And go to my Instagram where you can see me posting pictures naked. Maybe you will see that match between AJ Styles and my balls. Ah, yeah, okay. Hope you enjoy SmackDown. Great one. Peace, love, and hugs. It's been a pleasure.